Right, we're going to start looking at tolerance now. So we're just going to start off with um, being able to state the maximum and minimum amounts um, when you're given the tolerance. But if you don't know what tolerance is, it's essentially just like an error in measurements, like something you can be like plus or minus. Um, the example I would normally use would be, for example, like a bottle of, of like fizzy juice. Um, it might say 500 milliliters on the bottle, but whenever the manufacturer making it, they would maybe accept like a tolerance. So that tolerance could be something small, like they might accept 500.5, you know, up the way, and then go down to like 499.5. So it'll go like plus or minus. And that is essentially what the tolerance is. It's what is, you know, what is acceptable, like what between what two values. So um, with that in mind, um, if I told the size of parts of a fence are said to be 56 centimeters plus or minus three, state the, the maximum and the minimum value, okay? So all you've got to do for that is do 56, take away three, and 56 plus three, okay? So 53 is the, is the minimum and the max is 59, but just make sure you write that. So you write minimum is 53 centimeters, don't forget the units, and the maximum is 59 centimeters. For example two, the capacity of juice in a bottle is 250 milliliters plus or minus 0 0.5. State the maximum and minimum capacity of the juice. So with decimals is a little bit trickier sometimes. Um, the maximum for this one is pretty straightforward, it's pretty plus. Um, it's just 250 plus or 0.5. When we're doing the takeaway, you might want to lay it out um, just like that, just to make sure you don't make any Silly mistakes. So you borrow from there, make that four, make that ten. Ten becomes nine, which makes that ten. Ten take away five is five. Nine take away zero is nine, four, two. So it's 249.5. And then what you want to do is just uh, lay it out. Again, don't forget units. That's that. Okay. Um, sample number three. So the voltage of a battery states 0 0.4 plus or minus 0 0.02 volts. State the maximum and minimum voltage of the battery. Um, again, pretty straightforward. Um, you're just adding on and taking away. So 0 0.4 plus 0 0.02. 0 0.4 take away 0 0.02. So 0 0.42 and 0 0.38. Uh, maximum is 0 0.42 gonna write the word volts and then min is 0 0.38 volts okay right now we're gonna look at it with percentages um what we've then got to do instead is just work at the percentage first and then do exactly what we did so you work at 10 percent of 45 and then you add it on and then take it away so Remember that to work at percentages, so 100%, remember, is equal to 45. And if I will work at 10%, I just divide it by 10. Okay, so it's 4.5. Just move decimal point one space to the left, and it puts it in between the 4 and the 5, so 4.5. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to do 45 plus 4.5. I'm going to do 45 take away 4.5. Okay, so I can say 49. 0.5 that gives me 40.5 okay um, and then just state that so minimum is 40.5 centimeters and the maximum is 49.5 centimeters Right, um, so we're going to 80, 80 plus or minus 2.5%. So 100% is 80. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to find 25%. Um, and that's going to give me 20. Okay, because 25% is a, is a quarter. So find 20 is 12 by 4. 80 divided by 4 is 20. 
And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to find 2.5% by dividing both those by 10. So that's going to give me 2. There are other ways of doing it. Um, you could, you know, find 1%. Um, so if I find 1%, um, that would be 0 0.8. Okay. So then 2% would be 1.6. And then half percent would be half of 1, which would be 0 0.4. And then you could just add those two things together. And that would also get you 2.5. So there is a couple of ways of doing that bit. Um, can I rip that out? So then once I've got 2.5%, I'm just adding it on and taking it away. So 80 plus 2 is 82. 80 minus 2 is 78. So the minimum is 78. And the maximum is 82. And there's no units there.